I hadn't exactly retired, but things had sort of stopped for me at the end of the 60s, you know. I'd stopped getting first division offers, you know, and I was spoiled. I didn't want to go straight down to third division, you know. So I just took off and I did other things. And then I, I, was, I was actually in um, India when I had this telegram arrive saying, would I come back to London and meet uh, Dick Donner about this movie? and uh, that Brando was going to be in. And that was just irresistible, you know, to be in a film with Marlon. It was... Uh, Why? Well, because he... I mean, two actors of my generation, there were, there were, there were Brando and, and there was Dean, you know. They mm. were the two idols and, and Dean was no longer with us, but Brando was still around. So the idea of, you know, getting up on film with him albeit brief, was just uh, irresistible. Was it a letdown working with him, or did it reach expectations? Well, it wasn't a letdown. He, he was very different to anything that I'd imagined. He was... Well, he's hysterically funny, for, a, for one thing. And he really doesn't... Um, he really doesn't learn the lines, you know? He has them kind of written... He has them written up big, behind the lights, you know? So you can't really see his reading. And in the scene that I did with him, he was, um, I was, you know, you're waiting to do the scene, and I saw him, he had a little bit of paper, and he was... You're a really disgusting example of a Krypton. And, uh, Zad. And what he was trying to do, he was trying to learn the first line. <laughs> so that as he turned towards me, he could be speaking before he had it written down. Do you see what I mean? <laughs> that he was just trying to learn this one line so it looked natural. Mm. And I, I, just, uh, I, I just couldn't believe it, you know. And, and, I, and I, so I went up to him, I said, Marlon, you know, what are you doing? So I'm trying to learn this line, you know? <laughs> before... Uh, and I said, but... How are you going to play Lear and Macbeth, you know, if you can't learn a line, you know? And he said, I've learnt them already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just not a moment's pause. Yeah. You know?